All right, I guess I couldn't leave the snow just yet. Woo, 13 degrees. We are starting week five. This is day one. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. We are starting up week five now. Oh, weeks are just rolling through. We are still up here in the Pocono Mountains of Pennsylvania, and it is 13 degrees, like I said. Oh, we're gonna start this week off right. With a nice six miles easy jog, run, whatever, survival, and snow. So, bundled up real good. We have some gusty, gusty winds. Uh, we're gonna have some bad road conditions, but we're gonna do what we gotta do, and let's roll. Okay, so the frozen buns run is done today. Oh my God, it's cold. Six miles, 8.03 pace. Uh, a little faster than usual because I was just trying to get done at the end. There was no conversational pace today. It was uh, completely for survival. Anyway, we gotta get it in. We gotta get out of here. The rest of the week should be in Delaware. So, the next time, See ya. Oh, we got track workouts, tempo workouts. We all got a long run, legit long run this week. See you next time. All right, good afternoon, or almost afternoon. It is week five, day two, and we are back here in sunny old Delaware. And there's no snow, but there's plenty of cold. And uh, today we're gonna attempt a little bit of speed work and uh, see how that goes. And we're short on time, because we have to get back to work for appointments and stuff like that. So we're gonna just get right to it. So, uh, we'll get warmed up, get ready to go. We're doing five, five by 1,000s uh, at 5K pace, but we're gonna do it on the road and not on the track. So let's get ready to go. Okay. Got a couple miles of warm up in, and I measured out a thousand meters around this driveway. So it used to be the old school, and uh, we're gonna give this the old high school try. Try to do five by one thousands at 5k pace. So I should be able to do them around three and a half minutes, and then have a 400 meter recovery between each one. Let's we'll see how it goes. Not really feeling it today, but I'm trying to get it done anyway. Oh. All right, well, some days you got it, some days you don't. Yeah, I don't got it. In fact, I'm gonna walk. Oh, God. So, out of the five by 1000s I was supposed to do, I did three of them, and they were not great. The first one was 333, which is okay ish. Second one was 336. Last one was 339. Just going downhill. It's a combination of uh, a lot of things. Mentally, just not there. Definitely not there mentally. Wasn't feeling it today. Got a lot of stuff going on. Also, got no sleep last night. Related. Got ate nothing since last night or drank nothing since last night. Also related. And just dying out there. So, some days you got it, some days you don't. Today we don't got it, but we live to fight another day and I'll probably try this again this weekend. Also, I'm out of time. I really get back, get showered, get back to the office for some meetings. So, got that going on as well. So, just not there today. Anyway, we're gonna just uh, cool down and jog about a mile back to the house and go from there. Oy. All right, 
that's gonna wrap it up for today. Cool down is done. Uh, it was miserable, it was a total failure, pretty much. I did a total of 5.91 miles, averaging 7.45 minutes per mile pace for the speed work included in there. So usually it's a lot faster than that, but oh well. Anyhow, we live to fight another day. See you on the next one. Okay, uh, the camera died today, so we're on the phone doing our vlogging today. Today is week five, day three, and today is a nice six miles easy run. My question for you today is, what do you think about on your easy runs? So do you think about how you're running, how you're feeling, do you think about work stuff, family stuff, whatever else, world news? Leave a comment down below. What do you think about on your easy runs? All right, let's get warmed up, ready to roll. Six miles, nice and easy. All right, it's gonna wrap up for today, uh, day three. Got 5.81 miles in, had to cut it short a little bit because I got other things going on to get to, as usual. And uh, average 801 pace, not too bad since it's dark. I didn't bring my lights with me. So, anyway, it's gonna wrap it up. Anyway, leave a comment down below. What do you think about on your long runs? Uh, or actually, what do you think about on easy runs? That's a little bit different than your long runs. And uh, leave a comment down below. Anyway, that's gonna wrap it up. Gotta get in, gotta do a couple other things. We got a big weekend coming up, we got a long run, we got a track workout, to redo the speed workout that failed yesterday, and tempo run yet. Oh my gosh. So many things to do and not enough days. Anyhow, see you next time. Alright, we are back. Day, I don't know what day it is. It's day four. Day four of week five and we're going to attempt our tempo run today. No, we are going to do our tempo run today. No attempts here, no failure accepted today. Oh, it is a balmy 40 degrees, actually 38 degrees. Light winds for once, uh, five miles an hour from the north. So should not have too much of an issue with wind today. And we're doing one mile of warm up, six miles at marathon pace, gold marathon pace and one mile cool down. So a total of eight miles. And uh, yeah, I'm cheating a little bit today. I'm wearing, well, kind of cheating. I'm wearing my race shoes. I'm wearing a pair of Nike Vaporfly 4%. So uh, give me that little advantage. I could use a little extra boost today. I need the extra motivation, I got the extra assurance that I can accomplish this. And uh, I did fairly well last week doing a six mile tempo run. And uh, so check out last week's video if you want for week four. But anyway, let's get warmed up. Let's get ready to roll six miles marathon tempo pace. All right, still getting warmed up, just got started. Just wanted to put this reminder out that I will be calling out my mile splits after each mile during the uh, tempo run. So, uh, yeah, it helps keep me accountable and it lets you know what pace I'm running at. So, cause all you're gonna see is my ugly face and me screaming out numbers instead of uh, me running. So anyway, let's get, get doing our warm up here. Get ready to roll. All right, here we go. 0.05 until we get rolling for the first mile. First mile, 617. Mile two, 619. Feeling okay, not great. Mile three, 621. Time to head home. Mile four, 
605. Whoopsie. Mile five, 607. Whoopsie again. <laughs> Mile six, 607. Woo! Nice and quick. Too quick. All right, mile cooldown. Okay. <clears throat> Workout is done. Hmm. I run through the uh, splits real quick with you. The miles went as such. 617, 619, 621. And the last three, 605, 607, 607. They last three are way too fast. Uh, I did that almost on purpose. So I was just working on increasing my cadence without increasing the effort too much, which is kind of hard to explain, but it worked out well. I didn't feel like I was working much harder and I just increased my cadence a little bit and actually started feeling pretty good. So anyway, total of eight miles done with the uh, warm up and cool down average pace of 636 for the whole workout, 636 minutes per mile. So anyway, nice workout, perfect day. It's like I said, 38 degrees, almost no wind at all, and wide open roads, and I'm wearing my vapor fly, so all is good. Anyhow, I'm gonna get stretched here a little bit, stretched here a little bit, and get some lunch, get back to work. See you next one. Okay, welcome back. It is day uh, five, and uh, week five. Today is a recovery day, uh, not, no run day just recovery run day seven miles nice and easy nice and easy conversational pace yesterday was a tempo run it was a speedy tempo run a little harder than i probably should have gone but i was working on improving my cadence a little bit and it was just a perfect day out really today is another great day it's a little bit breezier uh it is uh like in about 40 degrees so not too bad out as far as uh running and uh yeah, this weekend's gonna be huge. Uh, tomorrow will be day six, scheduling our long run and in a monsoon. Apparently it's gonna be driving rains, 20 miles an hour wind. Uh, so fun, yeah. And then we gotta squeeze in a track workout on Sunday. So that's the, that's the plan for the rest of the week. But right now let's get warmed up and stretch a little bit and let's go run seven miles nice and easy. That's gonna wrap it up for today. I did that all wrong, way too fast and a little bit long. Average 733 pace, minutes per mile. <laughs> 733 minutes per mile and 7.32 miles. So, they ran too hard. Uh, short on time again today. Seems like that's the, I think the motto for the week is short on time. And uh, wearing these Topo Athletic Zephyrs running shoes. And if you run slow in them, you sound like a horse. I don't understand this. They clop, 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 clop. So I have to run faster, be efficient. I don't know. Anyway, uh, that's gonna wrap up for today. Big weekend. I'll see you on the weekend. All right. Well, it's uh, interesting out here today, at least. It's, uh, well, first of all, it's week five, it's day six of the week and uh, we had torrential rain earlier it's like 50 degrees out and it's kind of like getting bright but it's also raining i don't even know what to wear so anyway quick recap on the week day one was an easy run six miles day two was an attempt at speed work doing five by one thousands i failed at that i did three by one thousands with a one mile warm up and cool down uh day three was uh easy run i believe yeah had to be day four was tempo run where i did one mile warm-up 
six miles at marathon pace, which was actually faster than marathon pace, and then one mile cool down. Day five yesterday was easy seven miles at conversational pace, but uh, it was a little, it was a spirited conversational pace. It was a strained conversational pace. It was an argumentative, argumentative pace. How about that? I don't know. And today, day six, 12 miles, nice and easy-ish, and try to stay dry for the most part. All right, so let's get warmed up. Let's get ready to roll 12 miles nice and dry. Well, one thing that's convenient about my rain jacket is uh, when it's not raining, I can take it off and just carry it like a football. So now on my right hand, I have you guys. On my left hand, I have my rain jacket. Uh, and if it starts raining again, I'll just put it back on. But it's really kind of too warm to wear it unless it's really raining hard. done one thing I've learned over the years is if that is if that is that if yes that's right you don't want it to rain wear a rain jacket I literally carry this rain jacket for 11 point no I carry this jacket for 12 miles we did 12.2 miles today this is light and compact and carry like a little football but I carry this the whole time in fact, it got sunny out as you saw the video and uh, warm, really warm. Anyhow, let's see, 12.24 miles, did it at 7.56 minutes per mile. So a little faster than my easy runs, uh, mostly because I just wanted to get done. I thought it was a conversational pace. I was testing myself, I could talk easily. Uh, so it's still a conversational pace, but I uh, am having problems with these shoes, and I uh, finally think I think I've finally broken into these Topo Athletic Zephyr running shoes. I can give a, an honest review on them, and uh, yeah, we'll see. Anyhow, that's gonna pretty much wrap it up for day six today. And get in, got stretch a little bit. Very feeling very tight. Feet hurt from these shoes, and. Uh, yeah, I don't know. We're gonna do track workout tomorrow and it might be here in Dover, Delaware or I might go see if Donald Trump wants to go do a track workout with us in DC. So, and until then, see you tomorrow. All right, well, we made it to day seven and today's gonna be a hard one. Not gonna even sugarcoat it. We are gonna do a reattempt of the track workout that I tried on day two. So today is two mile warm up, five by 1,000 meters on the track, not on the roads, on the track today at 5K pace and with a 400 meter recovery jog and then two mile cool down. So it comes out to like a lot of miles. So two miles warm up and cool down, it's four miles, five by 1,000 is around three miles. So that's four, four and three is seven. Recovery jog, that's like another mile in there plus. So we're gonna eight something miles, eight point something miles total today. It's a beautiful Saturday, or so, yeah, right. It's a beautiful Sunday afternoon. And uh, yeah, let's get warmed up, ready to roll. All 
I've already got to the track and uh, some guys playing football over here, but that's okay. I'll work around that. Like I said, we're doing five by 1000s, 5K pace. And uh, yeah, hopefully we're more successful than we were Tuesday. It was Tuesday, day two. And uh, oh, wow, lots the guys here. Anyway, let's finish get warmed up. And let's get rolling. footage of the running today camera was blinking out on me anyway got five by one thousands done finally today uh, my goal is to do around three and a half minutes so it's about 5 30 pace somewhere around that area so first one was uh, three so three and a half minutes is my goal so first one was 333 second one was 331 and then the last three were all no the last two 329 so number three number four were 329 and the last one was 327 so i sprinted that last little straight away just to work on leg turnover a little bit and that's a wrap up for today that's a wrap up for the week hope you enjoyed the video give a big thumbs up comment down below what you guys do for your speed work also comment about what you think about on your easier runs subscribe if you haven't subscribed until next time peace <laughs>